Welcome everyone to my channel that is fast and easy maths which is dedicated to give you tips and tricks related to mathematics. So if you are new to my channel then please hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell button besides it so that you get notified whenever I push up a new video. Okay. So students today I am going to solve a question which was asked in one of these exams okay and the time limit given to solve each of these questions was 90 seconds okay. So basically you had to solve this entire question in one and a half minute okay and many of the students could not do it the reason being the given data is a little bit different than what is normally expected for these kind of questions okay so let's see how to solve this kind of a question the question says if 4 b square plus 1 upon b square is equals to 2 then 8 b cube plus 1 upon b cube will be equal to what so in such a question normally the kind of questions which we are expecting is like they have given you something like b plus 1 upon b is something equal to something and then they ask you to find b cube and all that b cube or b raised to 4 or b raised to 5 b raised to 2 something like that okay but here the problem is that the given data they have given us 4 b square plus 1 upon b square okay and we need to find something which is like cubes okay it's not even raised to 4 if it was raised to 4 we could have just squared both the sides and gotten our answer okay but in case of cube you cannot even make a cube out of the given situation why because you need to multiply this with another b to get your cube okay and that is right now not possible so what do we do we go back we will try to figure out if we can find something called as something in terms of b plus 1 upon b okay now how will we do that is let's see here can i write this as nothing but 2b the whole square plus 1 upon b the whole square actually is equals to 2 now understand if i want anything let me change the pen one second so now if i want anything in terms of uh, let's say i want something in terms of 2b plus 1 upon b the whole square okay i need to do something in that terms so that then i can take a square root and finally i'll get something called as 2b plus 1 upon b which will be helpful when i multiply this value with this one so how do i do that is can you see these are the terms which are nothing but if you look at your formula they are of the form a square plus b square okay so now if i add a 2ab over here i will get nothing but which is called as a plus b the whole square so simply i will just write 2b the whole square plus 1 upon b the whole square plus 2 into a which is 2b so 2b into b which is 1 upon b so 1 upon b okay and since i am adding something over here so on the other side of my equal to also has to be added with the same terms just to ensure okay sorry um, i am just going to add two last okay so now can i see the b's are getting cancelled okay so now what do i get over here is 2b square sorry we'll get 2b plus 1 upon b the whole square right because everything is in terms of expansion of a plus b the whole square okay now what do i get over here is 2 into 2 which is 4 which is getting added to 2 so we'll get around a 6 over here okay so can i say that 2b plus 1 upon b is equals to root of 6 taking square roots on both the sides now in order to get to 8b cube plus 1 upon b cube all we just need is we just need to divide or rather multiply this equation equation 2 with the equation given which is 1 okay so what do we get when you do that is 2b plus 1 upon b okay let's multiply this into 4b square plus 1 upon b square is equal to root of 
6. On expanding, I will get 8B cube. Right? Then I get multiplied 2B with 1 upon B square. So I will get plus 2 upon B. Correct? Plus 1 upon B gets multiplied by 4B square, which will get me 4B. Okay? And when I multiply 1 upon B with 1 upon B square, I get 1 upon B cube. And uh, sorry, here I will get 2 root 6. Okay, so this is still equal to 2 root 6. Okay. So now let's write down the terms which we want. Okay. Together. So we will have 8B cube plus 1 upon B cube together. And then we have 2 upon B plus 4B. Okay. This is still equal to 2 root 6. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. So now here if you look whatever we are looking for is already there. Okay. But we don't want this. So now let's try and take something common. If you take two common out of this. We will get 1 upon B plus 2B. Okay. This is equal to 2 root 6. Correct. And we know that this value is nothing but root 6. So I have 8B cube plus 1 upon B cube plus 2 into root 6. This is equal to 2 root 6. Taking the 2 root 6 on the other side, it will get cancelled. 2 root 6 minus 2 root 6. So my answer is 0. Unfortunately, this question was a TITA question. Means you had to type in the answer. If the answer was given, then also you could have done it by looking at your options and solving it. Okay. Students, before I sign off, I want to tell all of you all that if you like the way I'm explaining, then please go ahead and hit the like button. And uh, do subscribe to my channel for many such videos okay apart from this if you have any questions or any doubts then you can reach out to me on my email or you can even put it or put a question in the comment section i will try to make a video on that as soon as possible and i really apologize to those whose emails i'm not able to yet put a video or to revert back okay there are like a lot of emails coming in and it Sometimes it's not possible for me to reply all of them at one go. So please excuse me for that. So that's it for now. I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye.